Phoenix police are looking for a teenager who was kidnapped from his home during an armed home invasion that happened early Monday morning. This all happened near 88th and Indian School Road. One person was shot during this whole thing before the two suspects forced the teen into a vehicle and drove away. Fox 10's Stephanie Bennett joins us live tonight with the details. Steph? Good evening. Yeah, police are desperately searching for that teenager and the suspects involved. So far, they have not heard of or seen them since, but they're asking for the public's help trying to find them. For now, that man that was shot, police say is going to be okay. Investigators going door to door trying to piece together what happened after an armed kidnapping earlier this week. A neighbor in the area who wanted to remain anonymous for his protection says he saw it all happen from his bedroom window. I was awake around like two, two ish, talking with friends on the phone. And then I hear gunshots. It all happened around 3:15 Monday morning. Phoenix police say two men, armed with a handgun and a rifle, seen here, force their way into this home where multiple people were inside. Once inside, they shot one man who was sleeping and kidnapped 17-year-old Jesse Sines Camacho. We want to put on everybody's radar to please keep an eye out for these uh, individuals and also for Jesse. The two men forced Camacho into a dark-colored sedan and drove off. Any information you have, uh, again, we. Don't suggest that you approach these individuals, but again, just give us whatever information that you have so detectives can work those leads and, and again, hopefully be able to bring Jesse home safe and hold these individuals uh, responsible for what they did. For now, neighbors hope for his safe return. And that is crazy because I went to school with him last year. It was one of my neighbors and it was around my neighborhood and I never thought something like that would happen over here. Yeah, for now, police are asking anyone with information to get in contact with them directly or at Silent Witness 480 Witness. Reporting live tonight in Phoenix, Stephanie Bennett, Fox 10 News.